Can Solana overtake Ethereum? Watch until the end and I'll share some of the biggest news coming out about Solana. I think most people already know that Solana is far superior to ETH in terms of scalability, transaction fee, and speed. And Solana's ecosystem has grown exponentially since its pump. But I will say they are nowhere near Ethereum's network effects. And network effects are more important than people understand. And the thing about network effects is they increase as you get larger. Another potential risk to Solana is the circulating supply compared to the total supply. Over 40% of the total supply is still not in circulation. But Solana has built an incredible operating team and just raised $314 million in their last venture capital round. Typically, venture capital is very good at predicting these things and have the resources to make them widespread. Not to mention one of the lead investors was Andreessen Horowitz, which is a major venture capitalist out of Silicon Valley. There is a lot of speculation from investors that most of this hype came from the NFT craze in the Solana space and that they couldn't get into DeFi like Ethereum has with DEXs and lending and banking protocols. But I'll tell you that this is changing fast. The big news for Solana that will make or break the project is its expansion into DeFi. I think if they can break this, they will be around for the long term and could possibly overtake ETH eventually. These DeFi projects are things like Serum, Terra Luna, and Radium. Go check out those new exchanges and see if you can get some great yield. And let me know, do you think Solana can beat out Ethereum in the long run? I think they have the right momentum and infrastructure. But can they overcome ETH's network effects?